This is my voice before two weeks in France. Voici ma voix deux semaines en France. Koroa Watasi gafure en sud de Shukan Nyongo accusanto de Anasi Takodezu. To mój głos przez dwa tygodnie po tym, jak nauczyłem się polskiego, mając japoński akcent we Francji, Weteshiwa ima okeingia arimasen. Wait what? What the heck was that intro? Anyway, today is Sunday again, but we can't end the weekend without us. Duh, now, before we get into our first headline, we've got an announcement to make. On September 1st, 2024, we are holding the first AMA session on Reddit, and you can get to ask me whatever you want. The video will be on the G4PTV Extra channel. So don't hesitate to ask any question you like. If we don't have enough Reddit users for this AMA, we'll have other people do it instead. Now, what do we do first? Isn't that obvious? We check up on the requests, duh. Exactly. Firstly, we begin with the Discord requests. A kid blasts raw by Katy Perry through the school speakers. Yes it's the my own superhero incident all over again what did you expect? Oh no, no! Hell no, we are not going through this bullshit again. I agree, if we show that request with that song, YouTube or Spotify would take the video down for copyright. Screw copyright. Just show that request, or I'm forcing you into it. How about no? Travel guide, memeville. Wait, didn't we did a similar report about this before? I think so. We did the cringy memes on August 16th. Ah, uh, now I get it. This is memeville, the place where memes happen. The time. Back in the day, memeville was a peaceful and funny place for everyone. However, during the years 2020 and 2023, it got progressively worse because of the cringy memes rising, such as the ski bidet toilet, Quandale Dingle, and more. Hello, it's Quandale Dingle here. The McDonald is a chot Gucci TV. Breaking news good evening the government devastatingly declares that someone got trapped in a house that is completely messed up oh no help me please I'm trapped do de do 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 El lomina me is irresponsible da dandy cabe tome forte at attack and me pop the What the heck just happened? Well, now I know why Memeville's stability deteriorated. Anyway, a villager steals a burger from McDonald's and gets arrested. What the hell is going on? Every time there is a request, it's always about a certain someone stealing something. This is seriously getting annoying and out of control. You know what, I'll show them how it's done. There, try stealing now, thieves. Anyway. We'll be no back after the break with some YouTube requests. Stick around. Fiction. Kids, it's time to go to school. Hooray! We can't wait to go to school again. Reality. Don't let your kids rage be your nightmare. With the character back to school sale, you can get 20% off your favorite toys to keep your child happy and excited for the new school year. 
come and visit us at Character. Right, we are now back, and it's time to move on to our other requests you sent in. Interview with Michael from GTA 5. So Michael, you suck. Are you kidding me? I haven't even asked anything yet. I don't care. This show is a joke. It's not serious enough, and this news program needs to be taken off the air. It's not a news program, it's a podcast. Then why can't you make it at least lighter? This is a MCNGC ripoff, and I'm already hating it. If you don't leave this studio, I'll have security throw you out. Now get lost. Fine. Go to hell there. Hey, don't talk to him like that. God, that was the rudest guest I have ever interviewed. I hope nothing can get worse. Anyway, travel guide. Nestville, which is destroyed by a nuclear bomb, guest star, Chuck Baird, um, sure? Oh great, now the whole camera crew who were there on the town just died of nuclear radiation. That's crap. Anyway, epic rap battle, Steve vs- Please, for the love of God, no more brain rot requests, no more has been hotel requests, no more battle requests, nothing. Yes, we may have had rap battles in MCNGC anymore, but because I found it obsolete, we are not using that in this podcast. So, I'm just gonna forfeit this request right now. Milton, don't you dare. Oh my God. What the hell was that noise? Holy cow. That scream was so loud that I think all of Minecraft you heard all about it. Okay, well now I'm, I'm deaf. Anyway, zombie apocalypse with winner from TPOT. Finally, a report that only has one reporter and isn't brain rot, I think. You kidding me? I didn't even say anything yet and the apocalypse already stopped. <laughs> Oh, how ironic. Winner thought that they could survive a zombie apocalypse, but nope, that stupid baby creeper came out of nowhere and killed them. Wait, that was it. That was nothing. That was the quickest death I have ever seen in a zombie apocalypse live report. Oh excuse me, we have to go on a commercial break. Yup, you heard right people, Big Brother 3 is coming on September 2nd in the next two weeks, ya yeah, boy. Wow, I'm so excited for the new season. Hopefully it won't be as bad as the last one. Yeah, I just want season 3 to have less drama, more playful highlights, and more. But Milton, do you think you should be in Big Brother 2? Nah, I doubt that. But anyway, let's continue with the requests. Who does a pizza tower in Fujitsu guys? Excuse me, what, travel guide, the 1.14 village. Oh, so we're doing a travel guide in the new village now? That's cool, I hope it will turn out pretty well. This is one of the villages that you normally see in Minecraft, but are completely overhauled. The village, or what most people call the 1.14 village, was added in Minecraft in 2019 during an update that completely changed not just the villagers themselves, but also their residencies forever. Unlike old villages, the new villages have stray cats running around, and there is also an iron golem that always spawns there, as opposed to only spawning if a village is big enough. We asked this guy about what he thinks of his home. Nah, it looks good enough. It's better than living in a dump. Don't you dare walk away while I'm talking to you. Excuse me, did you just hit one of my villagers? What you did was completely disrespectful. Get out of here before I throw you into the air and kill you. Okay, fine. Sorry. However, we were forced to leave the village because I hit a villager whilst interviewing him. Later that night, a raid suddenly broke out where villagers tried to kill everyone. He better be 
I can. Let's go party a messe o o si sa. So mi ti mi a a a a a a a a a a a a a a Well, another tourist destination flopped, but heck, at least we got to see the new village that time. Anyway, V from Murder Drones vs. I- What the hell did I just tell you? No more. Battle requests. It's over. The end. Game over. Michael Bay ruined everything with these ridiculous cliches and other crap. And if I see one more battle request, that comment will be deleted. So keep it together, and request correctly. But what does Michael Bay get to do with that? Just roll the next request, woman. Okay, okay, okay. Take it easy. Anyway, no comment. Zombies take over the nuke nestville. Oh great, now the no comment camera crew got killed by the nuclear radiation too? No wonder why people can't go anywhere near that place. Oh well, at least that's one way of killing the zombies. Ha, huh. not today zombies. Anyway, zombie apocalypse report with Alex. <laughs> What the heck did I just watch? Anyway, things are a bit off in this village. There is a torch that isn't even supposed to be on the ground for no reason, and I don't know how it happened. It must have fallen off from that street light. Wait, what does that sign say? This villager has been banned from society for... For what? What did he do? Oh forget it, I'll never know. But all I know the most is that I have to find the weapons of course. Done. What is that music? It's like I'm in a disco club or something. Hey look, a police golem. I knew there was gonna be one the first time I went to wait. Is that a baby creeper in that lab? Oh hell no bro. Die. Where the heck did that thing come from? Shut up you stupid baby witch. I am not falling for that thing again. Then I'm going to kill Grekao. Are Grekao kidding me? Alright, so off camera I managed to rob a grocery store for pork gop, so hopefully I don't starve to death, or worse, get killed. Because if I do die, well, you know the drill. Wait, is it just me or am I seeing two police golems around here? That's sick. Come to papa or I'm sending you to India. What? Oh, for pity. It is time to put you to sleep. Shut your mouth, kid. We shut up. Phew, close one. What is that singing? There's no way I'll ever fall for that witch. Go to Sarducarjan. Oh, thank God. A police golem is there to help. Jesus Christ. I thought it was a baby witch for a second, but it was just a cow. I must be hallucinating. Okay, now this is getting really weird. Booyah, I survived the apocalypse. Good thing everyone in the village are still alive, especially this guy. Can you please let me go home? I'm starving. No. And here comes yet another travel guide request. This one is... The Nether. Wait, 
Are you sure this is going to work? What if the game crashes again? It won't, I promise. I can guarantee that this is really going to work. If this is a trick, I won't believe you. But anyway, let's go. After two hours of collecting resources, we have finally built a nether portal. I don't know what the nether looks like yet because this is my first time exploring it, so let's jump in. I hope the game won't crash. Is this a joke? How can the game crash when I just entered the nether? Like, are you kidding me? You know what, I give up. Damn it, I knew this would happen. Anyway, it's time to end tonight's episode. But we haven't even shown the other requests yet. I've been through enough today. I'm stressed, I'm tired, and my head feels like it wants to explode. I just want to go home and relax. Anyway, I'll see you next weekend. Goodbye. Before we end this video, I'd like to make a statement. As you all know, Milton often shows his anger over something that he doesn't like. For example, the Skibidi Toilet, Hashbin Hotel, and other brain rot content. He also doesn't like the battle requests because he thinks that they always get ruined by Michael Bay by not making it exciting, and he also hates the rap battle requests because it's not allowed to be on this podcast. I don't know why though, but whatever. The other thing that Milton doesn't like the most is having more than one reporter in a zombie apocalypse report. Now, put it this way. If we have over 10 people reporting once, it would waste a lot of time, it's going to make the report extremely long and boring. But now, we are going to change everything. As a request by Milton, and to save costs, we have changed our request guidelines. What does it mean, you may wonder. Well, you are no longer allowed to request battle or rap battle requests, and you are not allowed to include two or more reporters in a zombie apocalypse live report because it can waste a lot of time, and as Steve would say, there can only be one reporter. When I say one, I mean only one. In other changes, please do not flood the same request with different changes to future episodes, because it is very annoying to Milton and the rest of us. That is not what Minecraft News Gone Crazy did. And most importantly, do not put any brain rot characters in a request. These include, Skibidi Toilet, Baldi, the cast of Rainbow Friends Garden of Ban Ban, Poppy Playtime, Hashbin Hotel, and other brain rot shows. The only characters that are allowed are those from Disney Channel, Cartoon Network, Nickelodeon, and others such as characters from G4P TV, TEG 1994, etc. I know these changes are baffling for some of you, but we only did it to keep the requests friendlier, funnier, and not brain rotting, which is the one word I really don't like. Especially the content farms, which are far worse. But please, don't take out your anger and frustration over forfeiting the requests because, it's not our fault, and it's our decision, so don't cause drama over it. But please remember, you can request whatever you want, but you need to follow the new guidelines we imposed. One thing to remember, keep requesting a much better place for our fans and everyone. Statement over. Thank you for watching. What is that? Oh my god, there's a guy trapped in a well. Quickly, call the rescue team.